everyone welcome back to my channel so a few little things to say i feel like every time i have a video i have to say like some stuff but then they turn into like forever stuff so one i have a headache um i would consider it as a migraine because it started in charge earlier and then like it expanded to like a bigger headache so it's still there. It's not as bad as it was because I laid down for like four and a half hours. So yeah, and if you hear anything in the background, it's just my family because school starting up and my grandmother wanted to let me know a lot of other things. And then two, my hair like this because of church and I actually really do love this style. For some reason, it's like so awesome. So yeah. And then three, I was going to do this video yesterday, but... Adam was leaving yesterday. If you don't know who Adam is, that's my boyfriend. Um, I believe he is in one of these videos, so you can, like, you know, go through him and look for and everything. And then, um, yeah, we had to take him home yesterday, so he was supposed to go home today, but we wouldn't go home yesterday because we missed his family because he's been gone for, like, so many time. It's, like, weird. It's, like, wow. But, yeah, um, so I'm going to get into the video. So this is a, um... This is a face powder eyeshadow blush collection. I have so much makeup for a 15 year old. It's like embarrassing to be honest. Because like every store that we go to, I immediately either go to the clothes or go to the makeup. Usually when I was younger, I used to go straight to the shoes because I was in love with shoes. But I'm not really in love with shoes anymore because like they make so many kinds and like they're so expensive and anything. So I really don't pay attention to it. But also, we went to TJ Maxx last night after we took Adam home, and I was watching some TJ Maxx videos yesterday, and one of the YouTubers that stand out a lot that I watch, 11th Gorgeous, I was watching their video from, like, a few weeks ago, from when they went to TJ Maxx, and they, like, bought cheap stuff, so I was like, hey, um, let's see if our TJ Maxx is the same way, so I went to the TJ Maxx, and as soon as I got there, I went to the... Makeup, and I actually looked there, and their makeup is pretty reasonable, to be honest. Like, reasonable. Their clothes are expensive, but they're clothes, so I would say, yeah, they're gonna be expensive. But, their makeup is pretty reasonable. I wanted to get two things, but we didn't have enough money to get it, because we've been, like, doing other stuff. So, yeah. Um, one was, like, 6 9 and the other one was 4 9 See, this is when I wish I had my, my money, like, good, just in case I went to a store that I really liked. I could get it with my own money. So when I get paid the first, I'm just going to save my money and not like buy anything right away because yeah, saving is better than spending because you have all your life to spend money on what you want. But you also have this point in time where you need to save it because I'm going to college and I don't have money right now to go to college unless I get a free scholarship from some kind of wear. And my grandmother really wants me to go into swimming. So, I might, in the springtime, sign up for the swim team at the Dover Y if she's still working there. Because, why not? It's, like, better than nothing. And I also have a headache, so I'm drinking coffee. I went to church, and then I came home, ate, and then got really sick for some reason. Like, my headache got worse, and then my stomach started hurting. So, I laid down at, like, 2-something, and then I got up at, like, 6-something. That's a lot of sleep right there. That's like close to four hours of a sleep. I was like, wow, your girl must have been sick. Because usually when I'm like have a headache and stomach ache, I'll sleep for like two hours. But when I sleep more than two hours, you have to be worried because that means I'm totally sick. Like I'm pale white right now and my voice sounds like it's like cracky and all that. It's because I don't feel good right now. And I'm turning to this video because I was laying in the dark. And then I was like, you know what, I'm going to do a YouTube video because it's been days and I need to catch up on them because I know they miss me. Even though I probably, you guys don't. But instead of this being a long ass intro, we're just going to get into this. So these are the, this, and like I said, I have a lot of makeup. I'm doing this in separate order. So I have like a three organizer drawer thing. The first one has all my mascaras, eyeliners, um like liquid face things that you would put on your face like and then my brow stuff and all that other shit shiz so um and then the second drawer is my lip lipsticks lip glosses lip balms chapsticks all that and then the last drawer is this drawer right here which i'm about to show you and it has my powders my blushes my elf eyebrow thing which i don't know why it's in here but it is and then the rest of them are all eyeshadows 
and contour stuff and all that. So, if you guys don't already know, I'm not really wearing makeup today because, like I said, I had a headache. And you're going to church, and if you go to church and I wear all the makeup I usually wear, like I wear at school, then they're going to say something. I'm going to be like, you're 15 and you're wearing makeup. I'm like, yeah, you got a problem with it? Um, you can take it up with my lawyer. Just kidding. <laughs> but I actually had fun going back to church today. I got to see my parents, um, both of them, for the first time in like, like three weeks almost. So I was really happy about that, that I saw that saw them and that they were okay and everything and they're doing well. Now I know they're probably both heartbroken. We all miss our like I miss both of them, but my mom, my grandmother only misses my mom. But you know, your girl has to feel guilty of some stuff. Sometimes. Um, it's not that I don't talk to them on Facebook. I do. I talk to them on Messenger. I talk to both of them. But sometimes you can't talk to both of them at the same time because they're so busy. So it was really good to see them and then also starting next sunday i am proud to announce that i will be taking classes at the church to become a member um i don't really like believe in like what they believe in like i don't believe in the whole trinity stuff and all that but you know what i'm gonna try to i'm gonna try to go with it but i do believe that god and jesus are two different people i will always believe that no matter what church i go to Sorry, that's like one thing I have to believe that they're different. They believe that they're the same person. I don't get it. But I'm not going to go on to this stuff because everyone's a different religion. And I don't want like hater comments going down below. So just scratch what I just said and just forget about it. So we're going to get into this because this intro is like humongously already long. So yeah. And I got a phone call to make a date. So got to get into this. So I'm going to, um, yeah, I was going to like go from like, um, I'm going to start with the powders and then go to the blushes and then eyeshadows. But since I have more eyeshadows, I'm just going to go front to back and like, yeah. So I'll tell you what it is, tell you how I like it and um, where I got it if I can remember. Because your girl has a bad memory, especially since she has a headache. And I didn't want to drink any caffeine for a while, but this headache is killing me and water it seems to make it worse. So I got coffee because. I don't need it, but it just stains your teeth, so when I get in this video and that coffee, I'm gonna go brush my teeth. But yeah, so we're gonna get into this. So first thing here is this bronzer, and yes, this is from the Dollar Tree. I don't really use Dollar Tree makeup that much because some of it is like really, really bad. So I try not to use it, but this bronzer like matches my skin tone. It may not seem like it does, but it does. I like using this as like a highlighter sometimes too because it gives you that like glow see that glow right there yes so i like using this as a bronzer slash highlighter because i feel like it gives my face a more depth look depth look and looks like i'm human and not like some freako watch walking in the streets with like tons of makeup on her face so yeah i love this um this is in sun kissed um like i said this Mm, smells like soda. <laughs> so like I said, I have used this for about a year now. Um, it is really good. I suggest you guys get it if you're really loving um, Dollar Tree brand makeup. Because they have some good makeup there. I mean, I wouldn't get like maybe mascara or eyeliner. But like nail polish and like face products. Like dry face products. They're really good. Um... So yeah, you should, you guys should think about that. I believe this is e.l.f. Yeah, this is e.l.f. It says it like right there. The e.l.f. label has just worn off over the years. So yeah, I suggest you guys get this. You guys will see I have a lot of e.l.f. products in my makeup, lip, liquid face, and powder face items. I love like, uh, e.l.f. That's like my favorite brand of makeup. I will choose it over any brand of makeup. Um... I choose it over any brand of makeup, NARS, MAC, all of them. Um, I've never actually really had NARS and MAC, but I want to go into Sephora when I get my money and see what like kind of makeup they have and how much it is. Because I feel like um, I could get a lot of makeup with $140 is what I get, not to brag or anything. That's not a lot of money in my pocket. But if I do get it this month, um, coming up September 1st, then I am going to go to uh, some stores, like different stores, and then get like different makeup and try them. And I'll be doing a haul on it, or I'll just get like what I need. I was gonna get another pair of sneakers, but I can wait to get another pair of sneakers because I really don't need them. Like, so yeah, we're gonna keep going. Now this is my um, that's bronzer. This is my cream foundation or cream powder. 
this is an ivory my foundation actually matches this like this it has but the only thing i don't like about that foundation is it smells like sunscreen and i don't want to go to school smelling like someone that has sunscreen on her face and makeup that's just weird so but it is good especially when you go out in the summertime because your face won't get burnt while you're wearing makeup See that happen. So I love this right here. It's so soft and it's a pretty color and I love like putting it on my face because when I wear this and this together, it doesn't look like I have much makeup on. There is one foundation I do have that when I put on my face is legitimately orange. I'm like, what? Because I wore makeup last year when I was, no, when I was in seventh grade, I wore makeup on my birthday because I was turning 14 and... The thing on makeup made my face orange. And my friend Emma, she was like, Christina, why is your face orange? I was like, it's not orange. It has makeup on it. She's like, it's orange. So I had to go to the bathroom. I had to wash the damn makeup off. And I'm like, fuck. So yeah, this is also by e.l.f. Like I said, you'll see a lot of um, e.l.f. products. But I love this. It's really good. Um, I think I got this from Walmart or Dollar Tree. Um, you'll see a lot of this makeup. It'll either be from the Dollar Tree or it'll be from Walmart. Now, some of this I got for Christmas, so obviously I won't know where it came from. I could give a hint, because I'm also, during Christmas, they have cheap deals at Walmart for makeup. So, I usually go down the makeup aisle, and I have seen some of this stuff, so you gotta bear with me on this. So, yeah. This is, like, my favorite powder to use, so, yes. I had two of these, but the other one I was using, I threw away, because... It was really old, and your girl ain't got time to freaking, you know, fix it up. Um, now we're gonna go, okay, before we go on the blushes, I'm just gonna show you this right quick. I don't know why this is in here. I really don't know why. But this is my second brow kit in light. Um, it has a brown in here. The brown is, like, super dark, but I wanna try to, like, know how to, like, learn how to do eyebrows so much that I got this kit. And I was going to hook up one of the girls that I know on Instagram that knows how to do eyebrows and ask her if, like, she can hook me up and do, like, my eyebrows herself because she does pretty banging eyebrows. So, I was, had this kit there and I haven't hooked her up yet and I want to try that before school starts because then I can know how to do my own eyebrows and, like, have them better than this because they suck dick. So, they have a light one, which is, like, a, like, uh, if you're, like, have hazel eyes, usually your, like, eyebrows would be really light, like, not light, is like redheads but like light like kind of like a blonde girl would be i think i think <laughs> no like blonde hair people they have like light eyebrows so like that would be cool for them oh! so yeah and this is also again by elf i know you guys are like why do you have so many elf products so this would be really cool um i would put this in my purse but that color is like really dark on me and i already have like a little stick thing that i use so Okay, now we're going to go with the blushes. So, this is my favorite blush of all time. I had to take it out of my purse to put it in this video. But, yeah. If you guys want to see an updated um, what's on my purse, just like uh, leave a comment down below. And also, my room tour. I keep saying I'm going to do my room tour. I tried one time and it did not work out well. So, I had to quit the video and erase it. But, when I can, I will be doing my room tour sometime this week. Because, not this Thursday, but next Thursday, I start school. So... But this is my favorite blush. I usually use this also um, sometimes as a highlighter instead of a blush. Because I don't really like blush that much. So I use this either as a highlighter or... Excuse me. I'll use it in the um, crease of my eyes for like a little like glow show kind of cool thing. Yeah. And this is in blushing. Kind of cool. And like look at that. It's like freaking... Sparkly. I don't know if you guys can see it. It's like so damn sparkly. Like, yes. So I love using that. And again, it's e.l.f. That's like four e.l.f. products right there. Now, these two blush, these are two blushes. But I don't like blush. So I usually use these as an eyeshadow. Or like, I'll do the same thing as that. And I'll put it in the crease of my eye to go for like a doll look. Because this one um, is a blush subtitle. And it's in pink flinging and I got this from a friend of mine uh, my brother's uh speech teacher she was moving and getting a divorce so she gave us some of her makeup so I got this one um so this is the blush right here um it's really pretty and I like it 
it's like a really cool pink um and i like it but i don't really like using the blush part because i don't like blush blush makes you like seem like you're blushing say you go up to your boyfriend and then his best friend comes over and then you say hey and you smile and you giggle and laugh and you got blush on your boy's gonna think that you're blushing for him too like no i don't i don't pick those booms so i just use this as an eyeshadow um i don't really wear eyeshadow but i'm gonna start wearing eyeshadow this year because i feel like if i wear eyeshadow my eyes won't like pop out as much because people like call me bad names because of how big my prescription is because i am like almost not blind blind but my right eye is like not good but yeah so this is like a really pretty color and i suggest you guys get it like i said i don't know where my friend got my brother's speech teacher got it from but the packaging is also pretty i like it too this my brother got me for christmas at target and if you watched my lipstick lip collection whatever you want to call it you guys can also see that he also got me a red lipstick for christmas now there's one thing you don't know about me i don't really wear like a bright color lipsticks but what i do is i'll take my finger and i'll rub it on my lips to make it look lighter because i'm not all about that darkness i do wear nude lipsticks i love nude lipsticks any kind of nude i also wear like i also wear like maybe like a doll pink. I'll wear like doll colors. I won't wear bright colors. So this is another one. And this is in. Damson Mist. And I really like this. Um, I don't know how he got me a pink blush. And then a red lipstick. Like it's not Valentine's Day. But it was really cute. And I liked it. Um, I actually got to open this up the night that he got us the stuff. Um, which I was actually really cool. And like proud to have. But yeah. So that was really pretty. And this is by N07. I don't know why I was going like this. Because there's like no mirror. It's just like a thing. So this is by N07. I don't know what brand that is. But the packaging is not black. It's like a brown. It's like a brown black. So yeah. Um. Now we're going to go. So this is clean unique i think that's how you say it this has two um single shades of eyeshadow morning java and then pink chocolate and then a uh, one blush blushing blush powder blush it's weird blushing blush powder blush blush and this is in smoldering plum smoldering plum so this is what it looks like i don't know where the brush is because there was a brush in here yesterday when i this video i think not sure so these are the two eyeshadows right here. I don't know which is which. I would think this is the pink chocolate, but then I think that is, and that's the morning job. I don't know. But this is the blush right here, and like I said, it's in smoldering, smoldering plum. That's a pretty plum color. I would actually use that as a eye, as a blush, to be honest. But most likely, I don't really use blushes. I just use them as like eyeshadows or stuff like that. But those are really pretty colors, and I would definitely use those for, like, fall seasons and all that, and winter. Now, during winter, I don't use that much makeup during winter because makeup can dry your face out, especially if you don't use the right one. So, what I do um, in the wintertime is I do wash my face a lot in the wintertime, especially in the morning to go out in the cold. Because I don't wear a coat anytime during winter. I wear hoodies. That's all I wear during winter. So, it can be pretty cold down here in Delaware. But you know how it goes. So yeah. And sorry, that's my sister. This is from Ulta, but I got this for Christmas from the church that we go to. So I got it from one of the people from the church. This is a eyeshadow quad, and I love quads because their eyeshadows seem like less tense and they're so smooth and I just love them like with everything. So and they have like pretty colors. This is in the shades Truffle, Polished, Smoke, and Black Ink. They have this one as black ink, but I bet this is black ink, and then this is smoke. I think they have them, like, backwards. I don't know, but they're really pretty colors. The only thing is, I don't really wear, like, black, because it's, like, not my style. I feel like my sister's in here. She is. <laughs> That's my sister. So, anyway, yeah, I don't really wear black. If I do wear black, it'll be, like, a thin layer, and then I'll put, like, another color, mix it in with them, and blend them in. So, I'm really going for, like, more, like, better looks this year for makeup since I am entering high school, which is kind of cool to me. 
but I'm also scared. So yeah, I would definitely recommend like using these, and these colors are really pretty to be honest, so put that out there. Okay, this I got for Christmas in 2015, because I was like getting into makeup a lot, and I think I was like 13 or 12, I think I was 13. So there's no mirror on here, so I don't know why. But this is an eyeshadow, actually. It's step-by-step -step on how to create the perfect flirty eyes, which is weird. This is, so top row has the highlight colors. The medium row has the blend, use medium shades in the middle row. And then the third, oh, it goes one, two, three, oh. Oh, okay. And then the bottom row, add drama to your no. eyes with colors from the bottom row. So, is this how it goes? Highlights. This is highlighters. That's what it says. I don't know how those would be highlighters. They look more like blushes. Well, this one does. This row is shade use medium shades for the middle row this is actually a really pretty color right here i would actually use that and this is add drama to your eyes with colors from the bottom row so technically they say these are highlighters i don't see what these are highlighters now that could probably be a highlighter right there not that it's yellow and then this right here but i don't see how any of the other ones could be a highlighter but i would definitely only use these for eyeshadows because this palette is really pretty it's the pink fits palette it came with like the eyeshadow palette, I think, like, um, some lip products and stuff like that. This is, like, a little kid's, like, one, but I thought it was really pretty, and you could never be too old to be a little kid, so I thought it was really pretty, and I got it, but it's funny how the palette opens up like this. Usually, a palette would open up the other way. It would, like, like, the way you're reading, it would go like that, so I thought it was pretty cool that they had it the other way, so I'd totally use this. Um, I've actually used a couple of colors in here, I think. Yeah, I use this white up here. I can tell by the marks. It's like all. Some of these, actually all of these have like a little shimmer in them. If you guys can't really like tell. But they're like really pretty. And I would totally use this to be honest. Not to be wrong. This is an LA color palette in the world. In the world. In the um thing, Latus. I love this palette. I've had it for a couple of years so far, so that's pretty cool. And I have a blue, a pink, and a green. And I got this from the Dollar Tree because you can never go wrong with Dollar Tree makeup. This is the LA's colors. Now, these are all nude colors, except for this one right here. It's like a big white, and it stands out. These are all nude colors. I'm a big fan when it comes to nude eyeshadows because I feel like they blend in with my style more. I'm not really all about bright colors because I don't want to stand out in a crowd that I'm not wanted in. So, I usually use nude colors. Um, not so much white or black. Sometimes I'll use a gray depending on the color, but I love nude colors. I love also shimmery ones too because they stand out more in my eyes. But yeah, this is also really pretty and this is in traditional. This actually was my mom's and then she didn't want to do makeup for a long time so she gave it back to me. Um, and then I got really interested into it. As you can see, I've used some of them and she's also used some of them. The color I most likely use in this one is actually this one down at the bottom or this one right here because they're more of my style. Not saying the rest of them aren't, just some of them in here are really dark and I don't like that. So yeah, this is also a Dollar Tree brand. This matches with that one blush with like the little decoration at the side. This is uh, an eyeshadow palette and this is actually really pretty. I would actually use all these colors except for like the black and the brown. But these are really pretty colors. I love these. We also got this this from the same person that gave us the blush. These are really pretty colors. Especially this one right here. That's like the prettiest one here. It's like a gray blue and I love it. Um, but these are also nudes and then they're also sparkly. A little half shimmer in them. Only thing I don't like about this is the black right here. I don't like like dark colors. So I wouldn't really use this and I don't like wearing brown either. Maybe if I wore the brown and then added like a like a bright color in with it. See how that turned out. So yeah. Next we have this. This is a color workshop. This came in a kit, I believe, with one of the makeups. And it has a blush, a contour, and then, um, I don't know what this is right here because the word is, like, off of it. But I usually use that for a blush, too, because it's a really pretty light color. And then you have the contour and the blush, and then this one doesn't have, like I said, anything on it. And, like, it's off. 
but it's like a really pretty color and I would definitely use this. This I wouldn't really use because I'm not a big contour fan and that's like really dark and I doubt it would, oh it does blend in, oh okay, okay. So yeah, then that blush is in the middle. This, um, I totally forgot it was here, but this is another powder I used to use. It's by this brand. I got it from my brother's old, um, uh, this is a cream to powder foundation. Um, this is actually really pretty. I actually used to use this a lot too. It was like a really pretty coverage over the makeup. Sometimes I will use this just to add a little like bake. Cause this is kind of like a baking powder. Like it bakes your face for the makeup to stay on, stay on longer. So yeah. Also, I don't have a spray to like set my makeup so it could stay for hours. So before school starts, probably not before school starts, but I am definitely going to try to find a uh, system where a, like a spray I can like leave on my face so my makeup won't go wet because I don't want to sit in class and then all of a sudden I'm hot, I'm hot and then my makeup start running down my face. Like no. So here we go. I have two of these because one is my sister's that she got for uh, Christmas and the other one's mine. Um, I think they're both the same thing because they look like they have, like, the same colors in them. Yeah, they're, like, the same thing. Based... No, wait. Wait. Yeah, they're, like, the same thing, to be honest. So, one, again, is my sister's and the other one is mine. They're just these cool little eyeshadow palettes and, like, I'm putting, like, my finger in one color. Oh, wait. So, these, are again, are by e.l.f. Um, here, I'll show, like this so you guys can like see um so they're both the same thing my sister she's like not right so she um she doesn't like makeup so my sister she uh, my grandmother gave them t that to me because she knows I love makeup if you guys want to see uh, my uh, back to school makeup um video like my how I do my makeup during school link that uh, I'll leave that just comment down below I'm like out of my mind right now and I have this big ass pimple right here and it's like so obnoxiously annoying and then this is my probably one of my favorite eyeshadow palettes that I have I love this palette um oh and we got those elf palettes for Christmas I don't know where they got from I got this from Christmas from Santa Claus um with another like packet where I have like lipsticks and all that stuff so yeah I love this as you can see I have used it a lot so yeah i love this um i love the colors in them like i said i'm not big on a bright color but some of the colors like the first three the first four actually i do tend to use a lot when i have eyeshadow on um there's like maybe one day of a case that i may like outdo it and go like with an all color like bright green something like that but i love this palette it's so pretty it's by the workshop um and yeah I, if you ever see this in Walmart, you should, guys should definitely, like, try it out. Because it is, like, a bomb. Okay, we're almost done. We only have this palette and then another palette to go. This, um, this is what my mom got for Christmas. But she, like I said, she doesn't really wear eyeshadows. She usually only does lips. Oh, so, oh, so I don't know where that came from. So this is, like, a pretty, do these, do these brushes, like, fall? No. So these are, like, pretty, so pretty colors. Like, I love them so much. And they really do have a color to them. So, depending on what color you pick. I have put the purple on before. The purple really, like, blends out on your finger. But if you put it, like, on your eyes, it won't, like, have that color color. Which I love. But these are, like, so shimmery. It's, like, not even funny. And it has, like, a big-ass mirror, too. Like, look at, look at these colors. They're, like, so pretty. And then these down here are blushes. So, they're really pretty. So, the two, um... We're just gonna go like this, so you guys can see. So these two colors down here, they are blushes, and then the rest of them are eyeshadows, and they have like two blushes, brushes down here. These colors are so pretty, and they're so sparkly, and I love this palette. Like, look at them colors. Yes. Now, the blushes, since they're like really pale and like pink, I would actually use them, to be honest. Because like I said, they're not like a dark blush pink, so yeah. Last palette is, this is my favorite palette of them all. I got this from Five Below for like five bucks. I think it was five bucks. They also had a, like a gold one too, but you know, your girl loves silver. I like silver more than gold. So I had to get this and I got this, I believe with my own money or my mom got it. I don't, I don't remember. But this is my favorite palette. Then this one would, is my second and then this one is my third. And then I don't really have one after that. But yeah, this is my favorite palette. I love this palette. I would definitely get it again. 
only thing it is it's really dirty so you guys gotta beware because i use this palette a lot especially for like the first three colors and then the last two i use a lot i don't like i said there's a dark color here there's um a few dark colors in here i really don't use but i love this palette um in here you also had one applicator and then eyeshadow primer eyeshadow primer is i believe liquid it is a liquid so i put that in with the liquid items on the face i do use eyeshadow primer because i feel like eyeshadow primer keeps your eyeshadow on more i mean longer than what you do what it was if you didn't use it so yeah so we're going to get into this because this video is mad long as is and i need to hurry up and make that call because it's past eight <laughs> holy crud so this is the palette right here these are pretty colors like i said i use these first one two three four sometimes i use that dark color right there and then i use the last two over here so i really do love this palette it's like my favorite palette of them all it's like you can't take me away from that palette so yeah i would say that i would recommend a lot of these two guys because this is like they are really good quality makeup brands out there that you guys could actually you know spend good money on getting now not all of them are good makeup brands you can find some that are a little odd and off but you know you learn what you can get cheap i didn't put that out there cheap i don't remember how i had any of this so i'm just gonna like put it in here because this doesn't even go in here so yeah um i hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you guys for watching i'm so sorry that it's like probably one of the longest videos i've done so um i hope you guys have an amazing night and i will see you guys sometime this week um make sure you guys hit that subscribe button down there below because you never know and also turn on the bell because if you turn on, on the little sound thing every time i do a video you will get a notica notification that i have made a new video i want to thank you guys for watching this video and i hope you guys have a lovely night and um a good week and have a blessed one and i will see you guys next time bye